<coughs> yeah, a little bit of playing. I reckon we might be able to do something here. Tuck them underneath. Have a little play. The belly's got to get bigger on the fish there, isn't it? So what we might have to do is pick out some big horseshoes at the bottom. Yeah, all in good fun. All right, let's see what we can do with this little lot. I reckon there's enough there. I've got another pile like that. Let's just start. I'll catch you later. There we go. Just had four minutes to sit down in the garden. Oh, look at the plants growing. Look. I like it looking a little bit wild. That's my little meadow there. But anyway, back to the fish. Been using my um, rail track anvil to knock all the lugs down on them horseshoes. Lugs are nails, so they flatten out a bit. See these lugs and nails? Not good. That looks colourful, doesn't it? Against that um, sunlight shining through the fence there. Yeah, so let's jump on the chair. Does it look like a fish yet? Um, kind of. <laughs> Might have to change the head. Don't really like that head. That's all we can do. I'll be back. Well, changed it for a brake disc. Yeah, you know. What do you reckon, huh? What do you reckon? Done some more welding to the fish. Are you ready for the fish? Are you ready to see my fish? Da -na -na -na. There we go. It's part of the Ian Matthews fish challenge. That weighs nearly 60 kilos at the moment. <laughs> Love it. So, what I did was burnt the scales in. So, each one. Yeah, I oh know, snobby can weld better. And that is some poor welding going on in there, but it holds. That's all I was bothered about. I've got infill, the lips, the kissing lips. And then I've um, got to weld that on yet, and then we're going to put a top fin to it. And then I'm going to use some old saw blades and create a tail. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do with it afterwards, but um, hey, it's getting there. See you soon. Right, guys, we got a problem. Me argon has run out, but I've just found out we got until this Saturday to finish our fish, the fish challenge. 
I've tried welding with the MIG. It certainly ain't having it without gas. Just fell off. As you can see, all the welds just come undone. All right, prove me wrong. <laughs> that one might be all right. Look at the color, look. A few days, just out in the, in the uh, morning mist. Look at the colors. Wow. Right, so I've got to weld the fins on to my fish, and we're done. But I'm having problems getting all gone, all gone gas from my MIG welder. So, with a bit of luck, there will be an end to this video showing my fish completed. But for now, we're gonna to have to settle with this unfinished fish. <laughs> I don't know what to make of it. What on earth am I gonna do with it? <laughs> oh, I love it. Scrap metal. I could call it a horse mackerel, couldn't I? Horse mackerel fish. Horseshoe. Horse mackerel, yeah. Right, speak to you in a bit. Toodle pip.